everyone, lovely to see you. Zig needs a little bit of your help this morning. He was looking at his sounds this morning, weren't you Zig? And there was something he just wasn't too sure about. So I said, I bet the children will help you. Will you help Zig this morning with a few of his sounds? Oh, they're very kind, aren't they Zig? Yeah, well done everybody. So let's have a look and see which sound Zig needs a little bit of help with. He says he can't quite remember this one. If you know it at home, which one's this one? Well done, that's right. It can say two things, can't it? It can say oh, or it can say ooh. Should we do the song as well? Who wants to be a cuckoo? Who wants to be a cuckoo? Who wants to be a cuckoo? Oh, ooh, oh, ooh, oh, ooh. Well done, everybody. So let's see if you remember that one next time, Zig. That was the oh, ooh. Okay. Let's have a try at this one. Which one was this one? Give you a clue. It's when you've got a bit of a sore throat, isn't it? And the doctor wants to have a look and see inside your sore throat. Yes, it says, ah, oh, that's right. The noise you make when the doctor asks you to open your mouth and show your throat and you say, ah, oh, that's right. Open wide, the doctor said, ah, oh, ah. Oh. Let me see your sore throat, please say ah. Well done, everybody. So that's your ah. What about this one? Which was that one? Oh, you think you remember that one, Zig? Zig thinks it says a, a. What do you think, children? Is Zig right? Yes, well done, Zig. You are right. My ear hurt, I was in pain. A, a. My ear hurt, I was in pain. What did you try to say? A. Hey, brilliant job. You did well there, Zig. Oh, you think you know that one as well? What does that one say, Zig? E. E. That's the lovely smiley face one, isn't it? You're right. And it goes with the donkey song, where his ears go up and down. See the donkey in his stall. E O E O is his call. Well done, everybody. That is the E. And what about this one? Hmm. Zig thinks it says A A. Does it say A? <laughs> You're right, children. It says I, doesn't it? I. The captain said I I. The captain said I I. Stand up straight and don't be late, the captain said aye aye. Well done everybody and thank you for helping Zig with his sounds this morning. You all did a really good job. I've got a new sound for you today. This sound is the other bit of the sound that the donkey makes. When his ears are up he says e. When his ears are down he says o. Can you do that? Can you say e o like a donkey? Ready? E O E O E O and this is the orbit. Well done. Let's sing the song about the donkey in his stall. Are you ready everybody? See the donkey in his stall. E O E O is his call. Well done everybody. You can listen to that again if you wanted to and have another try. But that is our or sound. If we wanted to write or, you could all do that really well. I'm going to ask Zig if he can write or on the board for us. Are you ready, Zig? So he starts at the top, all the way around the orange. That's his first bit of or. And then he goes down, up, and over the hill. And well done, Zog. You have written or. Good job. Well done. Now we're going to play a little game today and our little game today is called Rocket Rescue. Rocket Rescue. Um, and to play this game you're going to need some to do some spelling, you're going to write some words. So you need your whiteboard and your pen or you need your piece of paper and your pencil so that you can write some words. And if you get them right, every time you get them right, we're going to put one piece of the rocket on the board we're going to see if we can repair Zig's rocket to get him all the way back to the planet Og because he'd like to go on a visit, wouldn't you Og? And go and see all his friends. So we're going to help him build his rocket. So this game is called Rocket Rescue, isn't it? 
and we're going to see if we can send you off in your rocket for a little visit. So the first word, children, I'd like you to spell for Sig is look, 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 look. And it's got three phonemes and I'll give you a clue. In the middle, it hasn't got an uh, uh, uh that looks like our usual uh, uh, uh. It's got a different one. So think about uh, ooh, uh, ooh in the middle of this word. So look. Look, look, look. Okay, when you've written it, we're going to ask Zig to write it and see if he gets it right. If he gets it right, I'll put a piece of the rocket up. Are you ready? So Zig has written look, look. Has he got it right? Well done, you've got look right, Zig. So let's put the first bit of your rocket on the board. Put it up there, okay? Well done. The next word I want us to write is, I'll leave a clue on the board to help you, foot, foot, foot. So I'm giving you some help. Can you write the rest of the word? Foot, foot. Right, let's let Zig write it now. Are you ready, Zig? Good. Now we've used the up uh, ooh sound where it says up, uh, and we've got foot, foot. Shall we build the next piece of your rocket, Zig? Okay, well done. We'll give you this bit next. Okay, we're ready for another word. This time we need to write two. So can you, everybody at home, write two? We'll leave you a little clue to help you on the board. Two. You think you can write that one? Go on then, Zig. You write two. Let's see, has Zig got it right? He's written two. Yes, well done, Zig. We'll give you another piece of your rocket. There we are. Okay, right, another word's coming up. This time we're going to write zoom, zoom. That's what you're going to do in your rocket, isn't it, Zig? You're going to zoom off to the moon. Are you ready to do zoom? Let's see, has Zig got it right? He's got zoom, zoom. Has he got it right? Yeah, well done, you're doing really well today with your spelling, Zig. Let's put your next bit of your rocket on. Here it is. Right, we're going to do the next word, children, which is food, food. You like eating, don't you? Yes, you do like eating a lot, I know. Food, food. Right, let's like Zig write food. You ready, Zig? What do you think? Has he got it right? Let's see, he's written food. Food, brilliant, Zig. I think we're going to give you another piece on your rocket. There you go. Next, we're going to write moon, moon. Can you write that at home? Moon. Well done, let's see what Zig's got. He's got moon, moon. Well done, Zig, you're doing really well today. I think you want to go up in your rocket, don't you? Let's have a look. Stick your next bit up here. I think you've only got one more bit of your rocket and then you can blast up into outer space, Zig. Are you ready? So the next one is going to be <coughs> soon, soon, because you are soon going to be in your rocket. Here we go, soon. A 
Have you written it at home? Well done. Let's see if Sig got it right. He's got soon, soon. Well done, Sig. I'm going to give you the last bit of your rocket. Let's do a countdown. Are you ready? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Blaster! And Sig has blasted off in his rocket. He's gone to visit his friends, but he'll be back a little bit later on, so you will see him again, don't worry. Um, your chilli challenge. I'd like you to make a rocket, and I would like you to spell some words so that you can go up in your rocket. Do some up or ooh words for me, and I'll see you next time. Well done, everybody. Bye for now.